was a graduate of Pan American College in 1968 and she went on to, for international fame really for her writing. Here in the Rio Grande Valley we wanted to recognize her because this is her home community. I know for many years, decades, a couple decades at least, of people who have wanted to memorialize Alfaduba at her own home here and so we are so glad to see this day happen. Going over that list of over 200 distinguished authors, we discovered Gloria Anzaldúa is the first Chicané author to receive this literary landmark distinction. <laughs> this is what the plaque says, y'all. Gloria Evangelina Anzaldúa was a queer Chicana poet, writer, scholar, farm worker, a 1968 graduate of Pan Am American College, whose path-breaking texts written in Tex-Mex, poetry and prose, have greatly influenced Chicana letters, LGBTQ plus studies, and American literature. Born and raised in the Rio Grande Valley of Tejas, her renowned work reflects very varied experiences of La Frontera and continues to resonate with and invite discussions about border realities across the globe. I change myself, I change the world. In this way, she encourages all of us, writers, artists, thinkers, scholars, activists, to allow our work to change us. And so in the act of creating, we create change in ourselves, and we just have to have hope that it's going to reach out into the community. And so that's what this literary landmark today is all about, is about her inspiring us to do work that matters. She said, Para la pena, it's worth the pain. Her work is very important for Chicana feminism, for women's voices, uh, for uh, Mexican American voices, but also for the queer voice. And to help people feel like, hey, I can say whatever I want. And I have to say it because it's part of who I am.